Today's episode of Beauty Trippin' is brought to you by T-Mobile. Binge watchers and music lovers, switch to the Uncarrier and do more with your data. Oh, oh my god! Jocelyn, here's our card! It matches! I'm sorry, I'm not over this! Is this a submarine? This Let's just perfect. get it before anyone stops us! <laughs> I'm afraid to see what's inside. Oh my god! Am I supposed to bring my stripper shoes? Do you have them in that bag? Uh, can I point out that there's a VIP lounge? And there's here? a disco ball. And this isn't even the beauty trip. Like, where what? are we even going? Where are we going? Okay, we're going. Las Vegas is one big circus. As in Cirque, Cirque du Soleil. Soleil? You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, we're going to the Mystere Theater at Treasure Island and Hotel and Casino. This is definitely Cirque wait, du wait, Soleil. Wait. I'm not very flexible. I can't touch my toes. I've been working on my middle split, so I feel very prepared. Okay, so we were in like Old Town Las Vegas and now we're going to like the hip, cool area of the strip where like people go to party and like pop bottles and How stuff. How do you know Vegas so well? Erin, we were just here like three weeks ago. But yeah, I don't remember any of it. <laughs> Somebody had a good time. <laughs> Is this a stretch? I'm pretty sure that's not what most people do on the pole, Is that, Jocelyn. <laughs> Is this what people do? Let's see if I can do a trick. Do a trick. <laughs> Me in the pole. Oh my gosh! Oh! You've done that before. <laughs> I'm gonna need a bigger limo, please. I'm sorry. I'm so excited right now. What is about oh to happen? God. Oh my gosh, we're so happy to be here. What are we doing? Where Ladies, are we? <laughs> welcome to Mystere by Cirque du Soleil at Treasure Island Hotel and Casino. This is Las Vegas' original must-see show. Today, Roger and myself will be making both of you up to be Mystere's original, iconic characters, the Red Bird and the Green Lizard. Us? <gasps> Dreams you? are coming true. <laughs> yes. Really? Yeah. Absolutely. Oh my God! Right I'm now? So excited. Yeah. 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 Okay. Are so you guys ready? Let's do it. I'm so ready. Let's head up. Come on. Come on. Follow oh us. Oh my. Gosh. All right, you guys, come on into the green room. Okay. <gasps> Aaron, awesome. we're gonna have you sit here. Jocelyn, you're I'm gonna be over so here. Okay. Oh, I love a good smock. Jocelyn, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm dying to know though. So, what do the green lizard and the red, the red bird, the red, red bird. bird, the red bird do in Mister? They're both acrobatic characters and they dance, <laughs> but they take the show from beginning to end. You see them throughout the entire show. Are they friends? They are friends, actually. They're both good characters. Yay. Okay. That makes sense. So you guys do all the hair and makeup for the Cirque performers. We actually teach the performers how to do their own makeup. I feel like this is really making my eyes pop. <laughs> Forget about eyeliner, hey. just wear <laughs> white makeup on your face all the time. So I can imagine it's like a ton of people's dream to be a part of Cirque. Have there ever been any like famous people that have come and been a part of any of the shows um, or anything? Actually, last year at Zumanity, we had Nene Leakes for a week. <gasps> you oh, did? Nene Leakes! Yeah, oh, yeah. I love and that her. was fun. So we happy. had a good time with her. Here's a good blending tip. Okay, okay we, we have these two different colors. Mm -hmm. We have the dark and the light. And you don't want to take your sponge and go okay. this way because it'll drag the white into the dark mm -hmm. and you don't want to do it the other way. So what you're going to do is you're going to go back and forth with oh. the sponge and it blends the two Are together. you a pro or something? I, I've never done makeup before today. <laughs> this is what they call beating your face. This is a true <laughs> face beating your face. Oh my gosh. Jaws, how are you feeling over there? I don't know who this person is in the mirror and I'm okay with it. So. How long will it take me to take all this off tonight? You may not get it off tonight, to be honest. What? No, I'm just <laughs> Here go my eyebrows. See you later. Okay, Jocelyn. If you had to name your lizard, what would you name him or her? Patricia. <laughs> Patricia. Patricia. I'll be Shelby. Shelby the bird. I would imagine it's pretty therapeutic to be able 
as a character to sit down and walk yourself through your makeup while getting into character simultaneously. It is, and many of them would say that, you know, that it's, it is a therapeutic process. It helps them get into their role. Yeah. And a lot of them will just put on their music and begin their process of transforming. And we perform wow. Saturday through Wednesday. So they're off Thursdays and Fridays, but it's two shows a night. Wow. Yeah. And so do they have to redo their makeup in between shows? Nope. How does that happen? That's, what? The process of them doing their makeup, setting it, and then doing powder over that really sets the makeup so they don't have to touch it up. <gasps> you they may touch up all lip. your tricks because that never happens to me. Totally baking. We're baking. We're baking. Baking my face. We're baking your face. AKA, what, are, what is what this? What are we baking? <laughs> um, we're baking some lizard. Yum. Actually, <laughs> what this is doing is this is setting all the creams that we put on there. Okay. Um, so that when you're um, performing, it won't sweat off. Right. I could use that in my everyday makeup. Like, yes, yes you could. Just Actually, on a different scale, perhaps? Like less, like a, like lot, a less. lot less, <laughs> like 50 pounds less. So if you could get your hands on anyone's face in the world, who would it be? Gosh, it would have to be somebody. I would love to, to, to work with Lady Gaga, just yes. because she's so adventurous when it comes to her makeup and stuff. Her David Bowie look. Awesome. For the, those Killed. Grammys, I think. Actually, the lady who taught me how to do hair in the 1900s. Oh, um, 1900s! Yeah, back in the 1900s when, <laughs> when I was learning how to do hair. I literally uh, say that all the time. She, uh, wa she was David Bowie's hairdresser. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, are you baking over there? Doing something. We're doing Getting a little baked. baking. Getting baked. We're at the bakery right now. <laughs> I feel like my face is not my own anymore. I would love to like make names up for cosmetic. Oh gosh, name one. Go. What would it um, be? Well, mine would be mine would be an eyeshadow, and it'd probably be Jolly Roger. Ooh, oh like yes, it. you have thought about that one for yeah. a while. Yeah. yeah, that came way too naturally. Right? Yeah, I mean, he's, definitely. He's got That's a library in his notes <laughs> on his phone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Look at those crisscross lace-up lashes. Pruning. Prune. You've got it down. You're such a natural pruner. <laughs> you know, I've been told that once or twice. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should rename this character the Prune Lizard. I would love that for today. I think that Prune has changed Roger's life forever. Oh, yeah. Would you like to put your headpiece on? What? Yes. Would I? Duh. girl. I feel like I might have a superpower that accompanies this look. And how it all matches up so perfectly. Goblin, you look wicked. You look I'm like sorry. A... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> do lizards do that? Or is that a snake thing? I don't know. I it might just a be a thing. Jocelyn thing. Probably. It's a Patricia It's thing. a Patricia. <laughs> Patricia loves doing... <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't even know what else to say about this. I'm my own spirit animal legit right now. This is incredible. Thank you so this much. This is amazing. You have so much talent in these little yeah. fingers Roger, of yours. You're the best. You're the oh best. my gosh. I would, I would oh my gosh. I'm so like high fashion meets really Forever 21 right now. <laughs> <laughs> Bucket list, wonderful. check, check. Now check, we're going check. to dinner. Bye. That was so fun. That was so much fun. Great job. Great job for us. Wait a minute. The headpieces. Hey guys, we need those back. Well, that was kind of cool. We channeled our spirit animal today, which is awesome. <laughs> we literally did. You guys, this has been so fun, coming to Vegas, going on a beauty trip. Like, what are we even gonna do next to outdo ourselves? You guys have to tell us, actually, because we don't even know yet. Nope. So why don't you guys let us know in the comments where you'd like to mm -hmm. see us go next on a beauty trip. And if you really want to see us go on another beauty trip, then you gotta subscribe so yeah. we can stay employed and keep making these awesome videos. <laughs> Anyways. Vegas calls, so we'll see you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Click to the left to watch us stuff our faces at a massive Vegas buffet, or click to the right to see our recent episode of Dirty Laundry that's dishing on all the best and worst dressed at the Billboard Music Awards.
Thanks again to T-Mobile for sponsoring this episode. Only T-Mobile lets binge watchers and music lovers do more with their data.